What's up, YouTube? <clears throat> Just wanted to uh, make a quick video. I think I'm going to try to start a series of videos. Um, I am living in the middle of nowhere in Arizona in a RV. And so I'm doing this for work. Um, work for pest control. Uh, it's close to Prescott, so uh, I'm going to be, I guess, the RV pest control guy, pest control RV specialist, something like that, I don't know, but uh, I think I'm going to put up a few videos about living out here and uh, living in an RV, kind of mix them together, work in pest control, and uh, Living the dream, kind of, you know, watching TV, but, uh, it's not terrible, I mean, living the RV, you know, bedroom, let's see, bathroom, toilet, it's a little bit dirty, but, uh, So, one of the worst parts about living in an RV. Let me close the door. So, I put the lid down, but when you sit down to use the bathroom, you're leaning. There's like no room against the wall. There's no room against the tub. You're just kind of stuck in this little spot, like cramped in here. So, uh, not very fun. Not at all, and then uh, very, very crappy water pressure. Um, kind of sucks, but you gotta live with it, whatever. Oh, and then um, sometimes just sitting here, the door opens, which is awesome. I opened it at that time, but sometimes it opens on its own. So, uh, you can just kind of look out the window from here. Hey, neighbors, take it a dump enjoying life but uh no so here's the shower i got less than a foot of space between me and the toilet paper and so every time you step out of the shower you're all wet and you hit the toilet paper roll and i always have soaking wet toilet paper which is awesome it's just fantastic all right let me walk through here uh, i get two channels. I have a, a satellite dish on top of the RV. I put it up. I have two channels. Infomercials. Both of them. Which suck. And so I have my laptop hooked up to the TV to, to stream Hulu. But uh, not very good reception streaming Hulu. It uh, always freezes up and buffers and whatnot. But uh there's my work truck, and right there, next to the uh, other camper, that antenna, that is the uh, internet pole, I guess. Supposedly, I have some of the best internet here because I'm closest to that pole, but it still sucks. So, I can only imagine other people in this RV site, what they're getting with their internet stream. But, uh, I kind of like it out here. Like, like you, you just kind of look out over, you know, the fields. It's pretty nice. So, other than poor water pressure and being a little bit cramped, uh, it's kind of nice. It's cheap being out in an RV park all on my own. Um. Uh, it's not uncomfortable. I mean, you don't get a whole lot of uh, counter space, and so, you know, I do dishes, set them here to dry. You know, just got the basic stuff. Let me shut this. Got a little freezer space, refrigerator space. Not a whole lot of food right now, just because I just moved out here recently. <sighs> but, uh, 
other than that i mean the bed's comfortable it gets pretty cold at night which is i enjoy because i'm used to living in phoenix where it's it could still be 100 degrees in the you know 12 o'clock one o'clock in the morning um 100 degrees out still burn your feet as you walk around but out here you, you're actually it's actually a little bit chilly when you wake up in the morning so uh i like it not too bad at all let's see i wanted to go over a few things just rv things that i you know had no idea about until i you know, started living in an rv park let's see it's gonna be a little bit hard to see but uh right there i mean there's some of my stuff but there's a that's the water pump which it gives you no pressure at all and it takes a lot of electricity so i never really turned that on and the uh actually just having the uh the hose hooked up to the rv gives you more water pressure than the pump which is awesome but uh let me see if i can so i'll go over a few of these little knobs so uh battery i have a full battery my fresh water tank is one third of the way full. My sewage is empty. Gray water, mostly empty. And my galley is two thirds the way full. So I didn't know they had little tester things on there that tell you how full stuff is. Um, and then right here, that's the water pump. Which. There it goes. Yeah. So I, I don't usually leave that on. And then that is the hot water heater, which it uses propane. There's, there's no electricity to it, and I don't want to waste the propane. So I've just been taking cold showers, which aren't that bad. But uh, sometimes I'll leave it on for an hour just to heat up the water, turn it back off, and use the water. For a shower and just kind of deal with what comes. And then these are those are heaters for my tanks. I guess you leave those on so they heat up a little bit, and it helps you dump sewage and helps having a warm tank helps it dump out faster and helps it prevent it from freezing up in winter. But, uh, I'm, uh, just sitting, watching TV, just, it's a day off, so I'm kind of bored, don't have anywhere to go, nothing to do, kind of sucks, but it's whatever. Oh, and something I wanted to bring up that I wasn't aware of was the, um, Paying for electricity here. <laughs> it's when I talk to them about it, they say they looked at the uh, the reading on the uh, the machine. They got the numbers, and so they're starting at that point, and then whatever it goes up, I'm paying for pretty much whatever electricity I use, which is good. I don't have to pay for somebody else's. But um, it's 19 cents per kilowatt hour, and they told me that, and I was like, "What does that mean? What is it?" So I only have to pay 19 cents, and I can use all the electricity I want in an hour, or I don't. I don't know. I don't get it. For a second, I thought they brought you chicken well, toes or one of you guys know what kilowatt hour is and no, 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 no. It's not how much I'll be paying, leave it in the, uh, the comments below. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna planning on putting up a few videos, um, you know, coming up just as I learn more stuff about the RV and as I'm. Uh, you know, working. Just uh, keep you informed. As of right now, I am clocking up.